Hello. Where My name is Homie wow. Diaz. Oh. First mistake. Didn't have no safety glasses. <laughs> uh, my name is Homie Diaz, and I'm a student at JTEC. And we're going to be doing uh, driveline phasing um, on a, I want to say, 90s Dodge, 2000s Dodge. One wheel drive. And it's a two piece drive shaft. So it has a, it has a uh, carry bearing. So, um, being that it's a two-piece, there's two different um, parts of the drive shaft that can be checked for phasing. You can check uh, from here to the front. That one, uh, that one, that phasing, and then from this one. To this this one, the the rear. So your, that's your two drive shaft that need to be checked for phasing. Or you know, if your customer comes in saying that they got a vibration, those is what that's what you want to check. Also, you want to check your bearings um, and your U joints. Uh, so what we'll be using is a digital protractor, and what we'll do is turn her on. And that, you know, that's not a big deal. It's uh, and a 18 millimeter socket because putting this on here, it'll give you a reading, but you know, you want to be a little accurate. So you want to have your socket as well. So I'm gonna try to do this with one hand. And since I'm just checking phasing, I'm gonna be going, oh, I can't do it. I have to turn the wheel because there's a clip in the way. Uh, you also wanna make sure there's no clip in the way as you're doing it. So we've already taken out the clips. And you you know, you wanna make sure that it's pretty level down the line. So, you know, down, you know, straight. So, uh, we'll put our our socket on there, and we'll get a reading. We got up 2.4 degrees. So, and I dropped the socket. And by the way, you don't want to change the angle, uh, the direction of your your phasing. So you don't want to start off this way and then go to the next one and do it this way so you want to follow it back so we had two up 2.4 I believe so now we're checking the first one and we got two up 2.0 so in this case the drive shaft is within spec and spec is no more than uh, degree of um, you know for your phasing you don't want to be no more than a do uh, one degree for phasing um, if it is it's out of spec it can cause a lot of vibration excessive wear and drive on vibration problem causing u joints to fail carry bearings to fail and, uh, possible damage to any other components attached to it so with ours being at uh, 2.4 and 2.0, our drive line is 0.4 out of phase, which is under spec. So that's a pretty good uh, degree to be out of spec. Um, and you'd want to do that with both pieces of the drive shaft. So basically, you'll Turn your drive shaft around. You'll do the same thing. You'll put your socket in your level here. And your socket in your level here. And check your phasing. And that concludes this portion of phasing. I'm a student at Jones Technical Institute. I studied diesel technology. Have a great day.